Hello and welcome to Confiance University. These are the topics that will be covered in the e-learning module, Viewing Business Processes with Eris Connect. We will first focus on the portal register. There are three main sections on the home tab of the portal register. The overview section provides quick access to relevant information such as people, discussions, navigations. My Activities lists any collaboration activities such as group discussion, comments on models, etc. The Contacts section lists all your personal contacts. You can drill down in the group structure and once a model is selected multiple tabs appear. The Overview tab is available for any model type. It provides the most important characteristics of the selected model. Depending on the selected model type, you will see Description, Activities, Roles, Departments, Systems, and Others. You can collaborate by following the model and receiving model-specific feeds. You can also post comments or respond to existing comments of the model. You can share models via email. This functionality is available for any model type. For the model you want to send, select Share Model. Select the user you want to share the model with. Choose to send a copy. Enter a subject or a comment. The selected user receives an email containing the information you entered and a link to the corresponding model. You can submit a change request to initiate a governance process for proposed process changes. A prerequisite for using this functionality is that the model attribute person responsible must be specified. For the model you want to provide changes, select Submit Change Request. Provide a title, description, priority, and documents if required. The process manager or person responsible receives the change request by email with a link to the relevant model for review. The Steps tab is available when any process model is selected in the group structure. It provides a simplified representation by focusing on single activities and is a step-by-step -step guide of the process. When a function is selected, its characteristics such as name, involved roles, supporting system, predecessor and successor functions appear. The Table tab is available when any process model is selected in the group structure. It provides an overview for each function of the process including roles, systems, predecessor and successor functions. You can easily change the style from table to matrix by selecting the relevant icon. You can customize the displayed content by adding or removing columns using the Add Column icon. In this exercise, we will follow along as the sales team is meeting to review the correctness of the current design of the sales processes and is using Aris Connect Viewer for the review activities. In order to familiarize themselves with the process, the team starts with reviewing a table of functions and assigned positions, systems, and data. Then they review the detailed process flow. Since some team members are not present, they share the model with comments of their review activities. At the end of the meeting, they compile a list of changes which they will propose to the process owner. The team uses the navigation to browse from the Overview Group Structure, to the Process Landscape, to the Core Processes, and to the Sales Process Group, where they select the Sales Processes model to get an overview of the model's activities and involved positions. They switch from the Overview to the Table view and start customizing the table to their review needs. They add a new column and select Positions. They also add IT systems and then sort the functions by process flow. The team can now discuss the functions, the relevant positions and IT systems and any necessary updates. 
The team now wants to follow the process flow and all its decision points. Therefore, they switch from the table view to the diagram view. They also switch from the comment section to the attributes and can now also review details of the model and of every selected object. Since some team members are not present, they share the model with comments of their review activities. They select the team member, provide detailed information and send the model to be shared. At the end of the meeting, they compile a list of changes which they will propose to the process owner using the Submit Change Request functionality. The team provides a description of the change proposal, sets the priority to normal, and sends the proposal. The process manager or person responsible receives the change request by email with a link to the relevant model for review. The Collaboration Register consists of three main sections which include feeds, groups, and filters. Feeds include personal feeds called My Feed, Company Feeds, and Portal Feeds. Groups are used to find or create groups for collaboration. Filters include My Bookmarked Items, My Liked Items, and Filter Created Based on Personal Filter Options. Feeds generally refer to any post, comments, or collaboration. Under My Feed, your own posts and posts from users or groups you are following are listed. Under Company Feeds, posts from everybody are listed. Everybody can participate even if specific people were addressed. Under My Portal Feeds, all models you are following are listed. The Groups section also gives you an overview of all available groups. You can join any of the public and private groups which are listed. Join a public group by clicking on Follow. Join a private group by selecting Send Request. The request will be approved or rejected by the group founder or coordinator. The Filters section lists bookmarked items, liked items, and allows you to create new filters for your feeds. Creating your own filter will sort feeds based on criteria specific to the filter, such as keywords, tags, author, etc. In this exercise, we will follow along as a new employee, Jane Dell, who has recently joined the sales team, is using Aris Connect Viewer to introduce herself to the process community, to become familiar with and follow relevant processes, to find and join relevant groups. Jane Dell is a new sales employee and is using Aris Connect to introduce herself. In her post, she is providing some info on her professional background and is including her LinkedIn site for more details. She also tagged the areas she is particularly interested in. Once posted, her post will appear in all company feeds for everyone to see and to respond. Jane is interested in finding all relevant information related to sales. So she is using the Find feature and is typing the keyword, Sales. The results show that sales info can be found in the portal area and also in the collaboration group for sales. She first opens the sales processes listed in the portal area. This will take her to the fact sheet of the model which provides her with an overview of the process model and she uses the follow icon to keep updated on any changes to this process. Since John Doe is listed as the person responsible for the sales processes, she clicks on his contact on the model feed which takes her to John Doe's info and she uses the follow icon to keep updated on any feeds that John posts. Jane checks her feeds on the collaboration register and notices that she has two notifications. She clicks on the notification icon and sees that John Doe mentioned her in a post and that John Doe, who she is following, has posted a feed. She marks all posts as read and closes the notifications. Back on the collaboration register, she selects Find Groups and decides to join the Sales Group and the HR Group. Since both groups are private groups, she sends a request to join which will be reviewed and approved or rejected by the group founder. Shortly after, Jane receives a new notification that her request was approved and that she is now following the sales group. 
After only a short time as a new member of the sales team, Jane feels already well informed about all relevant aspects of her new position and well connected to her team which she has yet to meet in person.